Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. I am the Armchair Grumpy, your host. Happy to be bringing you some more. <laughs> I was about to say Yakuza. No, this is Ghost of Tsushima. Uh, part 23? Man, this is part, no, part 24 of our playthrough of Ghost of Tsushima. We've actually beaten the main game. We're on to the, the DLC, the part of the director's cut. We're on to Iki Island, which is actually a really cool part so far. Um, both, like, I like all the DLC content when it comes to the, like, extra mechanics and, um, just a second. Phone's going off here. Extra mechanics and stuff like that that they've been added in. Uh, the, uh, armors and weapons uh the the horse armor which kind of sounds weird uh there's a, always a stigma against horse armor but this is really cool looking and it actually gives kind of a cool stat bonus um and buffs off in a, a new uh, a new ability uh to your horse the charge attack and uh the story's actually kind of interesting so far this weird trippy this weird uh, kind of trippiness. Uh, you've been poisoned by this evil lady. Uh, this evil Mongol um, shaman. And she's kind of in your head. She's not really in your head, but she's her voice. It's your thoughts. Like your inner deeper, e like your inner thoughts, the darker side of you. And um, she, it comes out as her voice and stuff. Like she's like telling you to kill people or um, like, uh, you know, like these people are going to betray you or, or like, uh, you know, like how you, uh, you know, like you failed to do something like, uh, of course, Jin is uh, Jin, of course, failed to save his father. Um, and so that's constantly coming up. Uh, he's constantly seeing visions of his father dying uh, when he had a chance to save him. So. Uh, stuff like that. So it, it's a, it's a very interesting. And so that mechanic, like that's constantly happening around the um, uh, the island as you go. Also, the different things like the the archery, the archery events, the oh, the playing the flute. I love that one. I kind of wish that was in the main the main game. Unfortunately, it's not. But it's a really cool extra. So I like the flute playing. Uh, it works very well. And, of course, this is all new armor. Except for the headpiece, I think. All this is new from the DLC. The sword, I love it. It's got a monkey, the feather, the monkey mask. This is the pirate outfit. Uh, the hat piece is from uh, Mythical. Either, I think it's a Mythic quest. Um, or it's from one of the fights. One of the duels, so... Actually, I can look at that real quick. But, uh... Yeah, so all this is... I, this is really cool so far. So I like this. Uh, I want to thank everybody that's uh, been watching on YouTube. Uh, we're going to be doing a big event here. Uh, not a big event. It's not like a giveaway or anything, sorry. Um, but we're doing something on Saturday. This Saturday. Uh, let me get the date, actually. That way, if you know... If you're watching... Um, uh, Saturday 18th, um, I'm going to be doing a stream, a uh, 24-hour stream. We're starting Cyberpunk 2077. We'll be done probably playing Ghost of Tsushima by then, and uh, Arkham City. Uh, we'll definitely be go done with Ghost of Tsushima. Um, we'll be playing that. So if you're over there on YouTube watching, uh, if you're watching the Crash Bandicoots, if you're watching uh, any of the Arkham stuff, if you're watching the Battlestar Galactica, if you want to come watch uh, anything, come over. Uh, come over to to Twitch. I I do stuff daily. Uh, I'd appreciate it. Otherwise, uh, I appreciate just a, a, a like or subscribe and comments you guys got. Um, uh, you know, be gentle with me. <laughs> but uh, the um, yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, so we're, we're doing that stream this weekend, trying to get to 100 followers. I'm up to 92, so if you want uh, uh, definitely uh, come hang out this Saturday. That'll be fun. Um, I'd appreciate it. Anything else? I'm trying to think. Yeah, if you're here on uh, Twitch, just uh, go check the YouTube out. There's a link uh, on the homepage of my Twitch. Uh, 
Got a lot of the back catalog of games that we've been playing and stuff like that. Um, also, uh, Discord. I got a link to my Discord to my discord on twitch you uh, if you're on youtube or on twitch uh check that out uh we're trying to that's where we're trying to get people together um to play on playstation uh to play uh kind of any game that i'm playing we can uh you know we can play the multiplayer of ghost uh the uh Tsushima's, uh multiplayer we can play um uh battlefield we can play uh crash team racing um, so when we get to 100 followers, I want to do something together with people. I play, we play Overwatch, I do a lot of Overwatch with friends. Uh, a lot of different games. I like playing, uh, I like, uh, uh, playing Evolve is fun. Uh, even though that's a, kind of a dead game. That's always fun to do with friends, because it's the only way to play it anymore. So, yeah, ch uh, check that out. Uh, come check us out on, uh, Twitch. Check us out on YouTube, the, the Armchair Grump. Uh, spaces between the words on YouTube, no spaces between the words on Twitch. Alright, that's over with. Let's get to the game. Alright. I'm really excited for Cyberpunk, though, too. Alright, yeah, we had a Mythic Quest over here, so... Mm, you know what? Let's just go on with the story. What's the Mythic Quest part? It is... Mythic Quest, someone at Fune's Refuge telling... Stories about a cursed set of Sarugami armor. Find them and listen. <laughs> yeah, not screw it. Let's just do the art. Let's do this. Let's do the mystic tale. The legend of Black Hand and Riku. Oh, Black Hand Riku. Yeah, let's do this. Wacha. 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 I love looking like the monkey. I really want a Monkey King game. There was one uh, be made by some individual that they advertised a long time ago, like a Japanese, a small Japanese company or individual working on one. Like he, he by himself, he was working on one or something called like a w w Wong, Wong Ku. I can't remember. It's like Wong Ku or Waiku or something. It, it's, I think it's the Jap no, Japanese, the Chinese name for the Monkey King. Um, but I haven't seen anything for it lately. I don't even know if it's going to release outside of China, to be honest. But I thought it would—I thought it was something to do with the P PlayStation. But it might be a next-gen thing too. Also, um, uh, what, what was it? Something that does a lot of Eastern mythology stuff. Uh, I think I think it did beyond beyond good and evil. But um, I haven't haven't heard uh, nor seen uh, hide. Uh, nose nor tail of it. I don't know. What is that? Something nor tail of it. I can't remember that that saying. Uh, of it lately. Like, there's just been no news. Like, of when it's released or whatever. Riku has taste for warriors. That sounded weird. I don't know why I'm gonna get this. Now let's talk. Talk man to man. クロデノ陸かつて息を苦しめた海賊の船尾さが墓穴から蘇ったのですよ。うん。クロデノ陸海で死んだと聞いておるが、採用です。柏と申します。わしもクロデノ陸の手下だったのですよ。しかし、あの
陸は幼子を海へ投げ捨て万の侍の皮を生きたまま吐いだのでございます手下は固唾を飲み陸のマシラは皮をねぶる地獄のありさまそれがゆえんでしょう手下どもは狂乱した頭を毒で死いそうといたしましたまずは胸をひとつき毒で目をつぶしてそれでも陸は死にませなんだ猿神の鎧のおかげでありましょうか陸は船を燃やしマシラと共に消えました手下は燃えて灰となり読みへの船でこと切れる前に陸はマシラの鎧を息の伊豆子かへ隠したとかかくて陸は怨霊となり忌まわしき黒手の陸の鎧を求める勇者と愚者とを等しくほふらんとしておるのだそうでございますさてもさてもおのおさんぐいふふらし かつて陸の下で働いたが手にかけたということか止めねばならんかったゆえ鎧は見つからぬままなのか挑んだ者は陸の怨霊に残らず壊れちまったようです息の猿は陸の眼と耳だという噂も立っとりますわでは俺が今
Can I go? Ah! There we go. Oh, I also, oh, I did mention. Once we get to 100 followers, uh, there's two things. Yeah, we're going to do a... Uh, this is kind of late, but uh, we're going to do a stream of playing together with followers, uh, multiplayer games and stuff like that. But uh, also I'm going to be getting uh, when uh, Harry Potter, uh, we might put the stream off a little bit, but I'll be getting that. Uh, if we get to 100 followers, I'll be getting Harry Potter, uh, the new Harry Potter game and uh, streaming it. So that will be the 100, uh, that will be the, we'll be doing a 24 hour We'll be doing a, a 24 hour stream of Harry Potter. Leg I think it's called Harry Potter Legacy or something like that. So, um, bug's not going off, so I think I've gotten everything. That's cool. I hope there's more quest lines in here. It's cool, Pirate Cove. Dude, if they had boat mechanics, like, that would be the coolest. But I don't think there's that. That's the one thing yeah, this game could have had. That would have been, like, made it top-notch. A lot of boats and stuff like that. It would have been awesome if there's boat mechanics. So that's the that's the way down. Would have been great if we just put, they put, finally, they just put a ladder I could go up and down. Down that side eventually. All right, and this is the horse armor we got last last round. Well, not last stream, the stream before last stream. Oh yeah. Oh, so so amazing. And it makes your char the new charge attack from the this uh game introduced a new charge attack, and it makes it even more powerful. And you're less likely to fall off your horse when you get hit. Either less likely, or you don't fall off your horse. I'm not quite sure. What is this? A helping hand. Is that a I guess we'll give for a battleground. Uh, I guess we'll we'll, we'll we'll go towards this question mark. Yeah, this charge attack's pretty cool. Some, di something I didn't really know I wanted is really cool. Oh, what is this? <gasps> Can I fish? Can I fish? Oh, it's a memory. I bet you it's a memory. Damn. I saw the fishing pole. I was getting so excited. I don't know why. That's just a personal thing. I want fishing. Fishing in Final Fantasy 15 is just fun. And how beautiful the scenery is. It just would work so nicely together. looks good. Waterfall Haiku. Mm -hmm. 
reflect on solace. Sora I definitely like that one. That was a nice design. The branch, it, that's gorgeous. Like, the headbands need more of that. More actual decent design. A lot of them are just really bland. I was expecting the the witch lady to strike. She didn't though. Let's go up this way. Storm coming in. Oop, flowers. Sorry. Ran into the tree. Oh, Mongol territory. Where, though? To the left. Is that where... We're going to the right. Is it a hot spring, maybe? Archery. on for this one. I want a mask on. That one works. Close. 
I think we can get her on the next try. Oh, point two seconds. Damn. If we're just a little faster. Now one more. Wait. Ichinichimo, isn't that every day? I feel like I started late. Oh, I missed. Damn it. I missed twice. Missed twice. That was a fuck up. Just, just late, late on that last one. Should I try going for the top first? Oh wait, I, I, I thought I missed. Damn. Uh, don't give up. I thought I missed. Mm, I missed that one. Nice. Yeah, I think this works well. I like that. Now, let's see. Uh, I was going to see. Is there a... Oh, I don't have any colors for the... I guess we can hit the ghost of Iki Island as our way over. I don't know what that is, the helping hand. I love how I just walk. I was gonna say, that thing's getting in my way. Oh, 
人だよ安全なところへ抜かれてないぞどうぞお受け取りくださいイスはバードを連れてきたお前は死ぬのが主情のためだ That was weird. Why did it show the helping hand over top? Some. Why'd the bird lead me here? Oh, interesting. Oh, demonic archer's mask. Oh, damn. Left behind by a mad murderous master of the bow who is obsessed with the legendary archer Uchisune. This mask cannot be worn with a helmet. Damn. That's cool. What are these drawings? Is this from something? Is this from something? Like, this doesn't look like a traditional Japanese drawing from back then. Like, this looks like a cartoon. A hippo with a present chasing a raccoon, dropping gold coins, and then a turtle. And yeah, this looks like from something. Huh. I wonder what that's from. Gotta be from something. Like, it looks stylized, but it looks too, like, uh, temporary. Contemporary? Alright, well, I found what I was looking for. That, that's a cool mask. Stuff like that, yeah. I want masks like that. That's cool. Kinda sucks that you can't uh, wear a helmet with it, though. There's something around here. I'm guessing it's up there. It's probably a Sakai banner. Hey yo, Dementia. Yeah, I figured I'd be on a little bit before he went to school. Dude, I just found the coolest mask. You want to see it? Look at this thing. This is like this demon, demon mask. Check this out. There you go. Now you can't wear a helmet with it, which sucks. But look at this thing. Kind of looks like the Tengu mask that the when you do the mythic quest of the archer. I, I think it's the archer, the Tengu guy. Look at that thing. That's cool. I want more masks kind of like this. Like, really out, really out there. Really uh, unique in design. That's cool. Kind of like the monkey mask. Uh, no, I I wasn't paying attention to it. Would uh, you don't have to post it unless you got a, like you got a, you got a link to it. Um, but who do they nerf? Do they nerf pretty much everybody? Is, is it a is it overall nerf or is it, yeah? Is it a overall nerf or is it certain uh, certain characters? You say tank nerf, so it makes me think like it's everybody got nerfed, like all tanks got a. Uh, it like they took down their health or like region status or something. 
Dude. Everybody got a negative 150 HP? How, how are they tanks anymore, then? So, that makes Ramatra... Ramatra was 450 HP. So he's just 300. Bastion has 300 HP. How are they tanks anymore? They barely do any damage. That was the whole point. They did less damage and had more HP. Oh, he had four... So, Ramatra had 400 HP? So, if he had 400 HP, he's down to 250, right? So, what characters got hit then? Because when I think tanks, I'm thinking all of the tank, all the su not support, all the all the tank characters, right? So, Roadhog, Ramatra, um, Zarya, the Doomfist, um, uh, uh, like everybody. Wait, how do they... So, negative 50 or negative 150? Ramatra did not have 550 health. There's no way he had 550. Arissa, Arissa had 600 health? Yeah, I don't think Arissa had 600 health. That would mean Roadhog... Roadhog had 700 health? I think... Yeah, I, may, maybe they got nerfed 100. 100 might seem right. Roadhog might have had 650. Uh, let me Google real quick. I think that's a bad move. I don't think I don't think tanks needed to be oh, I don't think they needed to be nerfed that much. Yeah, it does say. It says, uh, effectively every game mode apart from roll queue, which is weird. After the three season, C up, uh, season three update, game modes such as open queue will reduce every tank's hero's health pool by 100. Every tank hero's health pool by 150 points, making them much easier to kill. I think this is a bad move. I could see maybe 50 points or maybe even half of that, 75 points for some of them, but all of them do like far less damage. Like, like that's the whole point. They have more health. Damage characters do more damage. Tanks have more health. Like, I can't... I could see a small nerf. Like I said, 50 points overall. I could see a small nerf. But 150 points? Like, most of the characters are going to be... They are, they're they already pretty fucking squishy. I mean, not, not squishy, but like... With, like, a good player can wipe out a, a tank by themselves. Like, a soldier can DPS really high and take out, like, a D.Va or, like, like, it, 
I've taken out, like, I, I've taken out, I've seen other people take out tanks. Really. I, it's just, I, I think this is a bad move. I, I don't, they gotta stop, like, I hate game, I hate people that mess with the fucking, like, stop messing with the fucking, um, cake once it's been baked. Like, just stop it. Like, like, stop trying to add more eggs into the cake once it's bacon. Once, like, once it's baked, you don't try to stuff more flour in there. You don't, like, especially when it doesn't need to be fixed. Like, w like, what's going on? Is like, is like, there is like, are they like doing like, like, like big tournaments or something? And, and like, tanks are like, fucking wrecking the field or some shit. Like, I, what is it? What's, what's up with these huge shakeups? Doomfist has 300. He has bare. Doomfist has three. He's no. He's not a fucking tank anymore. He has 50 more health than most DPS characters. Ugh, I'm not gonna go on. It's, it's, it, they're stupid. Blizzard. Blizzard is just retarded. They just made all. They basically made tanks not tanks anymore, and they don't do as much damage as DPS. They just. They just wiped out the tank class. I, that doesn't make any sense. All right. So this record. On the death of my son. The very last time I saw my son, we fought. I thought the argument was important. Then, now that he's gone, I realize how petty it was. He was a beautiful young man. He had a bushy head of hair and a dimple in one cheek when he smiled. He loved to paint, and I can't bear to see the tools of his art go unused. Please take them, if you wish, and perhaps the spirit... Rush. Add beauty to the world. Cherish your loved ones. All vanishes too soon. That's sad. That's what I'm saying. Several, several of them are barely gonna have any more HP than a than a, the than DPS characters, and they um. They uh, don't do nearly as much damage. Some of them have a little bit of support in that they either like barely none of them have a heal. It's weird that some some it's just stupid. Like I said, I could see maybe a knockdown of 50 health. You know, like 75 is even I think too high, but like 50 health overall to some of them, but. I, 150, like I said, it, that takes several care. Like, I don't think Doomfist is terrible. I think he has a role. People, I've seen people play it well. Uh, I've seen people get into behind characters, dive, kill, kill squishies. Uh, he's the same thing as Moira. He's a dive character. I've seen him play well, but um, he's not like Ramatra, where he's meant to be like a frontline character that can just go ham sometimes, and people need to know what to do with it, like, need to know how to primary him off the field, or or even a Roadhog, where Roadhog gets up close and personal and reels everybody in, and he, stay, and he can take a whole bunch of damage. Uh, like, <sighs> I don't know what they're thinking. Like, first of all, they need to talk. I, I, maybe they made, maybe they made a, an explanation, but I don't see an explanation that fucking explains it. Yeah, they really don't have any point. You have D Why would I... I would rather play... Ba just play Bastion. Bastion has 300 health. He does more damage than any of those characters. Like, you would just... You wouldn't play a tank. There's just so many... A, 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 
you just play a DPS character. Just play a DPS character. They're going to be able to do enough DPS to just fucking wipe them off the field now. There's barely anyone... Um, the, the couple that have still 500 health, maybe. But even then... Um, so Arissa, but I, I still can... Yeah, so like maybe Arissa, but she uh, she doesn't do very much damage. She like is very unique in her role. Uh, she's a very low damage character. Um, people got to know how to use her well. So I'll have to check it out. I'll have to see how it plays after the update. Did they say when these these updates go live. <laughs> I know it, it yeah I, I don't get it I don't get it I think I thought they had a good balance but they're fucking themselves over Bl blizzard just wants to shoot themselves in the foot dude I blocked that s I, whatever I'll just never want to play tank again. Like, I didn't play tank that often anyways, but... I... Knocking 150 points off of everybody's health, there, there's not a tank I want to play. <laughs> if you make the average... If you make the average tank's character's health barely any higher than a DPS character's, you're going to take the character that has a little bit less health, but more more damage overall. You just are. Um, and a lot of times, the DPS characters have more mobility, have a lot more options. Um, yeah, just... I, I fucking don't know what they're thinking. That's the whole point of a tank, is to have more health. And they just, again, they did it to everybody. Like, they didn't do it to, like, a couple characters that had 650 health. Or 700, like, there's one character, I don't know who, somebody has 700 health, I thought, but maybe I'm wrong. Was it, somebody had, like, a huge, huge amount of health. There was a couple 650 characters. Like, they didn't do it to, like, a couple of the big boys. Like, they did it to everybody. Like I said, anybody that's 300 or 400 health, they're just going to be... I think they're just going to be pointless now. They're going to be too easy. Uh, it's just going to, like, trying to... Well, the other thing about it... The other point about a tank is having that extra padding... That extra health would be allow you to ram a tank into the like you would be able to ram a tank into the enemy, like they were the like the like vanguard of an attack a lot of times. A diva could dash in amongst three or four enemies, uh, with a healer on their tail. They'd be able to take a brunt of the attack, and then they could put up their like put up a shield, put up their shield or whatever their debuff. They, they could do something like that get distract distractions they could they could take a lot of damage maybe still stay alive 
and distract people or do something like that while the rest of the team was able to to do their thing um and now they're just they're not going to be able to do a lot of that stuff they're not going to be able to play like a tank like that's the whole point of a tank god damn it blizzard like i said stop trying to stuff stuff in like stop trying to change the cake after it's been fucking baked I there's I hate these live service games. I really do. Especially don't try to fix it when it ain't fucking broken. Like Blizzard, like it wasn't broken. None of this is broken, and they're constantly making changes to it as if it was broken. And they're they're just gonna end up breaking it, especially when they make such a huge. And I was actually liking Overwatch 2. I was playing quite a bit of it compared to Overwatch 1. This might actually kill it for me. I just might not want to play it. I like it's hard enough sometimes to keep uh it's seriously hard enough to keep um uh a, a, a tank alive sometimes. Like sometimes they will seriously dip into the red when I'm trying to heal them with mercy or something. And um Ugh. Oh, this, is, this is going to be murder. Oh, this is the guy making his house. Builders vow they burn my home and better refuse to give up. I can rebuild. I set out now for the forest to gather wood for the f walls. Then I'm off to grassland to hunt and hide for the roof. So I've helped him there. Both of those. I'm sure I can scrounge enough metal from shipwrecks along the beach. This should be all I need to build a modest home in Sly Hunter's Forest. I. Motaro, write this as a promise to myself. I will accomplish all this and more. So I need to help him. So I helped him with the wood. I helped him with the um, hides. I need to find him along the beach. All right, so that's what that is. That's where his house is being built. the option of slaughter. That's interesting. They actually went for the, uh... Normally they don't try to kill the hostage. I had the option to slaughter that uh, boss, but ugh, I missed it. Alright, there's an animal thing over here. What's this one? Monkey or cats? Oh dear. have a purpose <laughs> actually looks kind of cute 
母上は俺を鹿のそばに座らせ獣に古今集を読み聞かせようと苦労した I'll, I'll try it out but they, yeah, they just shot themselves in the foot I don't want to Charm of the、uh, Sugaru, Sugaru's Sight. The blessing of the deer Kami. Bows can shoot up to three arrows. Oh, pff, this is exactly what I was looking for. Bows can shoot up to three arrows at once if you have enough ammo. That's a charm. I was talking about, I was talking about the, the two arrows at once thing, and now this is three. Dang. All right. Wonder how you load it, though. Be interesting. Alright, so we were headed out this way. Let's, let's, let's hit this up while we're on our way. Oh, sorry, buddy. I love how these deer just run right in front of your pass. Uh, did it, it said it's season three live? Because that's when it said it was going live. Because、uh. I was thinking about playing this for like another hour and then hopping on. And, and playing a little Overwatch, but uh. <laughs> Attack me, dude. Come on. There we go. That was a, that's a cool pose after he sliced him right through the gut. Wait, is there an enemy nearby? I don't think so. I was, I was actually going to play some Overwatch. Now it, it really is. I really don't want to. I'll, tr I'll try. I'm going to check it out. I'll see if they、uh, went up to stuff. The, I'll see. I'll check it out. Ugh, it's still. St it's, a, it's infuriating me. That's why live, like, live service games are the dumbest. Like. You should, you should fix a game if it's broken, right? If something's broken, fix it. But don't fucking keep changing a game once it's, like, working. And it wasn't broken. They didn't need to fix it. There's nothing to fix. Like, maybe, like I said, they could have maybe worked. Like, if, if, if tanks really were a problem, like, if they looked at the thing and it was, like, tanks were, like, majority of causing of wins or, like, A、majority of deaths were healers and something else, and tanks were not dying at all. And like people were picking tanks over everything else, then maybe, yes, maybe try to balance the tanks down a little bit.、Um, but I, I highly doubt it. It seems like this was like a just stupid decision. And another thing a game company needs to do when they make a decision like this,、um, I'll have to check. There was a, there was a release, is like. They needed to make a video or something explaining their reasoning. That's why I think Final Fantasy XIV, the, the guys that work on Final Fantasy XIV are really well liked, is because they explain a lot of the, the stuff that they're doing. So. The video is still. I mean, the video. The, mu the music's still going like I'm in combat. And I can't talk to him. I, th I think he still thinks I'm in combat. Right, let's see if I. Can I. Can I have quick travel? And quick travel means that I still think I'm in.
I cannot fast travel during combat. Am I still in combat now? Yeah, I'm stuck in combat. Why am I stuck in combat? I think this is a glitch. We're gonna save the game. Then we'll uh, exit to title screen. I like the music though. Guy's name sounds James Bondy. And let's hit continue. Hopefully that'll fix things. I haven't had that happen before, so it seems to be an odd glitch. Maybe it's because the uh, bird or uh, somebody ran away and it just didn't take them out of combat. Or someone's glitched through something. Approaching enemy territory, you can challenge foes to a standoff. Yes, we know this. Oh, you tried... Are you trying to play it right now? Are you, have you tried... You tried playing it since the new update? I, I can only imagine. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Like, I... I'm telling you... I've... I'm telling you, I've seen... Tanks can still be melted through. Yes, they have more HP, but they don't do as much damage as DPS. And that's the whole thing, is like, obviously I think like, it, tanks should probably do is like half as much, or like 66, like 60% or something of like damage compared to DPS, and they have, but they have a, like, a, like 75% or like, they have like, like 50% more health than DPS. And, like, there's balance and trade-offs, and, like, that's what I said, like, max 75 points. 50-point knockoff, maybe, like, 50, like, I think 50 could have been okay. But, like, 150? That's what I thought. That's what I said. It, it, that, brought, that brings a couple tanks down to 300 health, and that brings several down to 400. It, it, it just, they're basically not, ta they're not tanks anymore. It's pointless. There we go. I wonder how the community will receive this, and I wonder... I wonder how much of a backlash they'll get. <笑>あ、そうかい。クロード様に礼を<笑> Somebody's going around pretending to be me. Isn't this the second time this has happened?
Dude, the the way they put these people in these uh Mokuta. pillar these like pillars is ugh. I don't know why it like freaks me out. Like it seems so fucked up. Oh, I have a point. I wish it wouldn't do that. I don't know why I can't go to menu when it's, like, doing certain things. That annoys me, but... I'll get over it. Find the Iki... Oh, no, the Guiding Wind uh, to discover archery challenges. Any? Alright, that's the last, last thing to get. Flowers? We've got a decent amount of flowers, so that's nice. I think we bought quite a bit of stuff on the island when it comes to uh, appearance, so. This is cool looking. Those houses over there? Looks like farmland. It's a lantern thing. Morch. Alright, so I steal and shit. Okay. Hit the barrels for distraction or what? That's bullshit. I'm sorry. You could just make it so people can... You can just make it so people can only choose two or three tanks at most. If there's three tanks on the team, you can't choose more. You could have just done that. Or you could make it so people can't choose more than two tanks. Once there's two tanks on the team, is lim is locked. You can't get more than two tanks. That would have made a better decision. Than nerfing hunt like that's so stupid. Let's nerf. All, let, let's just fucking ruin all tanks. Let's just fucking ruin all tanks. Blizzard's so dumb. I I should have stand. I should have done something. I fucked up. Oh, dumb dog. Get off. You need to die. What? Fuck off.
Yeah, that's the dumbest reasoning I've ever seen. Just make it so that you you, you can't play once you hit three tanks. Like you can't play over three tanks. Or there might or make it so um, there's a character that uh, you could balance it so that DPS gets strong. Like once you hit three care, like DPS gets stronger or something. Uh, like does more damage once you hit a limit of three tanks or something. I don't know. Like you could balance it better, way better. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, get it. Ha ha, we are yoke. Kekoya Gakumun ni hagemu oreo. Instead, they decide, let's just wipe out the whole point, the uh, purpose of tanks. If every if if every game did this like MMOs or like any game that had tanks they they, they just wouldn't exist anymore. Like it's the dumbest thing ever. It, it's a whole it's all about balancing and they they just decided let's just just take away let's just take away the, the point of the class. Like but it's just it, this pisses me off so much. It's so stupid. It'd just be like go like Ghost of Tsushima. If they came in, they said, "Ah, this armor piece is too, is too powerful. Let's just let's just nerf the fuck out of all armor pieces, or let's just like take away all attributes, like all attributes to the armor pieces. Like it's just stupid." I want to go after the ghost. Or I'll come back and find whatever the bird's going after in a little bit. It's not here. Do I need to find his tracks? Clumsy. Uh, I, I can't see his tracks. I see a footprint. Guessing, there we go. クロードに用がある。島の半分が探してる。だがこいつは渡さんぜ。こいつには大きな狩りがあるんだ。こちらにもな。一日だけだぞ。それ以上待つつもりはないからな。して思いが噂のクロードなのだな。あははいえいえ
a standoff? Okay, we'll do a standoff. Funubakarika. Hey, he's got my monkey hair. What? ケイの証しです。何よ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ。ケンジ
I think a good one would have been the the pirate lady that heads up uh, Umo, uh, um, Umugi Cove. Like they could have had like she could have been a, a very interesting character. They could have done several quests with her or quests out of Umugi Cove with like interesting and unique pirates. Um, they could have had like a farm with interesting characters. There could have been a lot of stuff. A lot of the quests, like a lot of the side quests, are good side quests, but they needed more. Uh, they needed more. Like the characters needed to be more developed uh, and stuff like that. And the other thing too is like they needed to have more cutscenes. Like like the camera, you needed to be able to see their faces. Them, you needed to see them emote and see them see those characters more for some reason the, the it's always panned back and you don't see their faces very well and like and it's very hard to connect with the characters for me it's very hard when you don't see their faces it's very uh, you're very un, it's very unattached it's like this you're constantly pulled back it shouldn't be pulled back like this i should be seeing his face right now that it would make it a lot better I don't know why it's like this. The camera should be going back and forth on them as they're talking. And I don't know why. Now, he does a good job with the voice acting. So, it it, there's actually a part of the human brain. So, making something uh memorable and making it like making you really latch onto it and stuff like really helps with attaching to seeing human faces and stuff like that so um seeing them emote uh seeing them um you know do interesting being an interesting face uh interesting personality um really helps and that's why there's the whole the whole reason why we have the the movie thing where the camera really cuts back and forth a lot. I'm not saying you can't do cool things where there's side shots or shots that pull back or that are pulled back or something. But when you're always pulled back and you can never really see their faces, you know, you're very disconnected. It's just a disembodied voice a lot of the time. Um, you really want to be seeing their faces. And the only time they really have cutscene, they have very few cutscenes. I don't know if it was to save money. I don't know. Like, like Mass Effect does a very good job of this, where you're always going back and forth between the characters and seeing their faces. Uh, uh, um, uh, even if it's in-game stuff, where you're just in a conversation, the camera goes back and forth. Uh, and also, um, what's another one? Like... Um, Witcher, The Witcher 3, the camera keeps going back and forth when just even during a conversation. And even if it's like just a common character, like NPC that you only see once, like you really get like the most common one I can think of is the, the quest to find an old lady's frying pan. And she is just an interesting character because she's a unique model. Uh, she has an interesting personality. She has a in, it look, the way she acts and stuff is very different. Like she she's quirky. But you remember her, like, I can remember her because of that. And it makes the quest very, like, it's just a quest to grab a frying pan out of her room. And, but, like, you remember her and the way she acts and, and because of that. So, it, it, yeah, if if the quest was, if the, the whole quest was just the camera pulled back and you never really saw her face, it'd be a disembodied voice. It, it, it would be very different. There's a reason why they do that. And I and I think this Nate game needed to, to do... To it needed to do that, so... I don't know why it d doesn't do that. I don't know if it... Uh, it might, it might have been a choice. It might have been a a mistake. Like um like this is the first time they're doing like Sucker Punch. I think this might be the first time they're really doing a game like this. They did the infamous games, but they didn't do like they haven't done like an oh like a, a game per se like this. It's kind of a different game. But... <laughs> yeah, Yakuza. Yeah, Yakuza is a good example. Where you're constantly, the camera's panning back and forth between the people as they talk. Uh, they're very unique, so um, uh, they're very memorable. Like, I, uh, like 
and they're unique like besides the, the way they act or their voice actors or whatever um like you get into the story i mean you get into those characters and your your face remembers them and the actions that happen during those scenes and stuff when you're you're closer up in on them if the entire time the camera was pulled back um and you really if you were just from a, a side angle and pulled back it, it you just wouldn't have that per it, you you feel less pers it feels less personable uh when you're up like if you're viewing their face like you're looking at them as if you were you were Jin and then you're looking at Jin's face as if you were them it feels more personable and you get more connected to the the conversation and the story so it just tends to help and it makes it more memorable Also, just a lot of these, uh, a lot of these quests with like, um, with Kenji are really well done. So I wish there were more uh, side characters like him. Like I said, the the pirate lady from Mugi Cove would have been a great one. So I wish she was a character. She would have been cool. Walking direction. <laughs> yeah, the characters in Yakuza are all very tend to be quite memorable. Mass Effect, uh, The Witcher Three. Shirinuguiをするつもりはないだが侍から逃げ回っているという独者には会っておきたい。Uh, the other one too is instead of giving even if it's just a one-time person don't just call them peasants give them a name let me you know giving them a name uh like i said they have a unique face let me see their face it helps you can, can, connect with the story if it's just peasant it feels like they're an npc so there's a lot of little touches you can do to make it make the, the quest better Chop off other things. But he hand, hand over Miko. Was Miko the the his 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 uh, jackass or the mule? <laughs> <laughs> this island's really nice. I really like it. It's well crafted. They do that well. They they're very well at crafting everything else. They just work on their side quest. To work. If they work on their side quest design for this the next game, I think the the game will be top notch. It's the only thing I think they need to really improve. More quests like this with Kenji for other with other side characters. If they could get like six or seven other side characters like Kenji and have side quests with them, um, then I think they would be like, like the game would be like ace in the whole like game of the year. Like this is still pretty close, but like I mean like it would just be like above above the not above the rest kind of game. This is a solid like eight point five to, to nine, so. The Viper's Den. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, me? That's what he's just got a great character. I don't have money, but I have supplies. Well, I do have gold. Kenji, I have to go when my planet needs me. <laughs> All right, buddy. Go, you go survive. I'll be here later in the day. Hmm.死んで当然の男だった。父上の敵が俺の敵とは限らぬ。そうだな。恨みつらみは飽きないの邪魔でしかない。それで侍が俺に何の用だ。ケンジから
聞く耳は持たんぞ千金を望むなら一とせほど待つことになるぞ<笑>俺は構わないまことか今払ってもよい欲しくないか猛虎から逃げるためにただし額を減らせこれで手を打てお主とて賢治が死なずに全て払えるとは思うまいひどい<笑>小賢しいとも思ったな賢治ここは一つ手を取り合おうじゃないか酒井様実は大高族に海図を盗まれちまってな唐国との抜け荷の海路が記されてるもんだそれに本土への道もだろうああそうだ猛虎に読み解かれでもしたら鎌倉の水軍の弱みを握られることになるそれは不安がいっぱいでは我らで取り戻すだが本土へは賢治も乗せてゆけああお安い御用だ検事に気をつけな油断すると厄介ごとを運んでくるぞ There's something in this village I can get It's this way Treasure an old man told me to reach <laughs> That sounds weird and oddly sexual an old man told me to reach his hidden treasure dun 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 before the mongols Amy plays on fools or could he have sailed with black hand Riku himself find the coast up to the nearest watchtower when the sun touches the horizon follow where the shadow leads you at water's edge pace yourself towards five uh forward five times the number of temples and sanctuaries and Iki turning left is forward the same as before through the spy hole the distant rock is the way an actual hidden treasure or all right uh travel to outskirts of the mongol camp with kenji not that far Hoi. もう冷やしましたよ。独自の信用を得た。身を取り返すぞ。俗に縛られた時、どっか痛めたみたい。盗みは不具に任せて、足は休んだ方がいいかも。ただの漁師なのだろう。恩人のな。ええ。まあ、
Oh, just come on, I can do this. Come on. It's all about my lousy aim. Oh, dude, point three. Damn, so close. Ah, shut up. Go. Let's go back and meet up. He's following me. This is really cool. The uh Bumpe no Kazuma Oina. I shall not go in the Gorimas. Nanikaraba, I don't dash us. It used to be all a town here as turns Purd calls. しがすすむべき道とは何だ。一人前の男として境を守り、それは父の言葉である。俺の答えを申せ。情け。弱き者のため力を振るうことです。What? No way, you dick. <laughs> Fine, whatever. Ah.
Oh, how did I miss? Damn bird. I hate those birds. Is it better to shoot? Dude, I just shot you with an explosive arrow and you might die. I feel like the explosive arrows are not as powerful as they should be. Like, is an explosive arrow, and it explodes on their armor, and they just kind of like meh, meh. Feels like there should be like a black powder bomb or something, like basically on the end of an arrow. Guess I need to find them. They're up there, okay. I think it just took me back to the general area. Here, give me a signal. Okay. Let's return to the search area. These them? Dokuja no Kaizu meets Kedo. Seems like a. Seems like a random place to put them. Oh, I guess it's gonna fast travel us. <gasps> Got a new mask? I think that's the ghost mask. Yoku yatta. 
すべてあるなしばらく海路を調べさせてくれそれから出発だあしらの前に着いた人はあ乗せてやったが船はもういっぱいだ余計な荷を捨てたとしてもせいぜいあと一人分ってとこだな賢治備えはもう立ちます直だあとはお前だけ仕事ができて楽しかったぜあんたとな俺もだ本当に乗らない逆だるに隠れちゃえばいいんですよ酒井様はお尻が小さいですし油でも塗れば<笑>遠慮するまだやることがあるのだではこれでお別れですねうまい酒を取っておいてくれまたいつか共に飲もう喜んで何か忘れ物ですか足の両親をね<笑>恩返しがまだだった船に乗れでも賢治様、うん、早く行け代わりに足が乗るぞよく心を決めたな足は何とでもなりますからでもフグはそうじゃないこれでいいんですもしや明日とお別れできると思っちまいました<笑>逃げられなかったな。一杯飲みますか Couldn't care run away. 息のクロードに。その名は忘れちゃいましょう。So, I'm guessing this means we're gonna have some more stories with them. Charm of perfect landing, gain resolve after sexually performing a safe landing. Okay, that's interesting. That's an easy way to get resolve, I guess. That definitely sounds. That sounds like something Kenji would have, right? Especially like safe land, like he's just a lucky bugger. That also seems like that. Like that what the heck? Like, he got a. Oh, there, there's two of them laying in the same spot. That was weird. That was weird. Freaking me out right there. Um. Yeah. Kenji always uh, lands on his. Oh, it's because Kenji always lands on his feet. Get it? That's kind of cool. Yeah, so th that, that's definitely Kenji. He, uh. He, he's really a good guy. Gets in all that trouble, but like he's, he'll help anybody. Like he'll help somebody out, even if it like kind of puts him at it, at risk. All right, we're gonna. This, it's got a repeat thing there. What is that? Duel the Viper. I never dueled the Viper, though. Weird. Interesting. Maybe, cause, maybe I was able to talk my way out of it. Hopefully there's not a trophy about winning all duels in Key Island. Let's see here real quick. There's two hidden trophies. And then the exploration part has four hidden trophies, so I, I, I don't know. Uh, then, well, there's one. No, okay. Complete all Boken duels at Hidden Cove, so that seems to be something different. 
So there is a duel thing, but it's at Hidden Cove. But what's a Boken duel? Is it something different? Oh, we got ourselves another shrine. I don't know what is up with these shrines. I don't understand that what I was supposed to do at the other one. Read scroll. First green of spring sickens to black decaying. Plagued by blood and beast, hunter reject death's allure. Propelled to duel man's frown. Guilty. It'll say, it'll say unsolved, or unfinished, or something. Clean. I don't know what to do. Like, plagued by blood and beast. Blood stain. Sounded like I was shooting a tree. Do I need to come here when I'm blood stained? Do I need to go hunt an animal and get blood stained or something? I don't know. Well, I think we're going to go ahead and end it there for the stream. Um, uh, that was a good place. Uh, the ghost story. When we come back, we'll continue the uh, mythic, the legend, uh, uh, the mythic tale, the legend of Black Hand Riku that we picked up at the very beginning. And, um, yeah. Before we grab this, uh, we'll get uh, the horse armor dies. But yeah, we'll pick this tail back up when we return. We'll do that later today. Uh, I'm going to go check out um, the dumb updates. We're going to play a little bit of Overwatch. I'm going to check that out and see how terribly ruined it is now. Because tanks don't exist anymore in the game, pretty much. i got to figure out how... I, I just don't understand... Ooh, I don't know how those candles are still lit. I need to figure out how these shrines work. This one seems like it wants me to go kill an animal and come back blood covered or something. First green of spring sickens to black decaying, plagued by blood and beast. Hunter reject de reject death's allure. Prepare to duel man's frailty. Blood to stain shrine. Uh, I, I'm at the shrine. Hello there. I, I'm at the shrine. I don't see any way... Is there a way to, like, trigger these things or something? They seem like there's a riddle involved or something, but... Concentration mode. Concentration mode... I'm not seeing anything. I don't see anything special. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, it's not a simple, just come here, do this kind of thing. It seems like there's some sort of riddle involved or something, because you got to complete them. Don't know what... What was the other one? The other one says... Stone knows no season, nor the colossus that was, fell to save one soul wanderer. Come uh, like through mist, a ghost casting no shadow.
I mean, it, this one literally says, Wanderer, come like through mist, a ghost casting sh no shadow. So it makes me think I need to use the flute to bring the fog. And then it says, casting no shadow. So I need to come from a certain angle, or I just need to like make the fog come and then come through a certain direction, maybe? I'm not sure, though. It, but it seems like there's a riddle. This one, Hunter rejects death allure, prepare to duel man's frailty. Hmm. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll figure it out. I don't want to go straight to looking something up on the internet, so... But we'll come back. Uh, when we come back, uh, we're going to be doing the... I'll be back later today, and we'll be doing the Legend of the Black Hand, and we'll be picking up uh, the colors for the die, and we'll do some so other stuff, too. Uh, but I'm going to go check out Overwatch and see uh, what terrible destruction they have done to that game. I've actually been enjoying it. Oh, why is... That was weird. Why was it, like, crumbling? Something about these statues. All right. Thanks, everybody, that's uh, stopped in and watched. Thanks for hanging out, Dementia. Hope your day at school goes all right. Um, I will be back in a little while. I don't know. We'll, we'll probably play... Equip? Equip something? Equip my ghost armor. Get my ghost armor in front of the shrine. Oh, Shrine of the Shadow. Yeah, let's uh, let's fast travel over there. Let's see. Yeah, I'm at the other one, so I have to fast travel over there. I need to equip it. So let's see, let's change the Kensai armor. Then... Oh, and then throw a smoke bomb? Oh! Yeah, it is a... Okay, so... Smoke bombs. A ghost through shadow. What the heck? Ask of the Colossus, face of stone unyielding. That's fucking cool. That is cool looking. Dude! Is that supposed to be from the Colossus game? Is that one of the Colossus things? Wait, you even changed the armor. Like, it's, I got the mask, uh, it also got the armor is different. Okay, so I'm, I can't equip anything with the mask. And then, Armor of the Colossus. That's cool. That is wicked, dude. I like that. Hey, thanks for the help. That's really cool. Dude, I like this. That is... This is so cool. The, dude, the the armor and stuff in the DLC is like some of the coolest. 
Like I love this. Like I got like some like the monkey outfit and stuff. The pirate monkey outfit on. This is wicked awesome. I wonder if this if this has anything to do with when the Colossi from the Colossus game, uh, the I can't remember what it's called, the old PS4, uh, the PS3 game, PS2 game. I knew it. I thought it had something to do with like, I knew it was like I knew it was a like a a, a riddle, but I didn't know if it like had to do with actual fog because you can you can use the flute to to bring a call the fog in so. Uh, armor of the Colossus wrapped in the strength of a forbidden land. Yeah, I think this actually has to do with um, the Colossus video game. I think it's like a it's a, a reference to it. Dude, this looks so cool. Dude, I actually want to go around like this now. Damn, I like I can't choose now between the monkey and this. Like this, that's actually cool when a game has too much good stuff. It's like you can just not choose. Cause this is what I go around normally. I like playing the monkey, the monkey king. I just need a. I like this. I got my sword's got. I don't. It's got feathers on it, but it's also got a monkey on it. I like this sword a lot. I have to figure out the other one. I'm gonna try the other one later. Hunter, reject us, allure, prepare to duel man's frailty. So this one, like, this one makes a lot of sense for what you had me, like, had me do. I'm like through mist, a ghost casting a shadow. So throw a bomb at your feet. But this one, so in the ghost armor, but then hunter, reject us, allure, prepare to man's frailty. I don't have hunter armor. Do I? Is it I, uh, hunter armor? I have... Um, a hunter. Have Ronin armor. This kind of feels like old games, like where you had to like like figure stuff out. Uh, have this like this would make me think a hunter, a bowman, but or the wanderer's outfit. I don't know. In attire. Oh, they totally changed up my Ronin attire. This is not the. This is not what this should look like. I hate it when they do that. Well, we'll figure that one out later. But these are cool. So these are different outfit changes. That's cool. No, don't tell me. Don't tell me this one. I was gonna figure it out. I want to figure out the. I'll figure out the riddle. It's a Kensei armor. This one's a hunter? This one's considered the hunter? I, don't, I would not put this one with the hunter, but it's belonged to Straw Hat Infamous for his cunning and deception. I don't know why this would be considered a hunter. I don't want to... Nature increases resolve gain. I'll try something. I'll try something out. I'll try it. I'll figure it out. If uh, I can't figure it out, I'll eventually I'll probably go to it. Yeah, because I was like the other one. That one seemed straightforward. Uh, the ghost and the smoke bomb. If I if I didn't if the fog didn't work, like using the flute to call in the fog, and like sneaking or something, then I, I, the smoke bomb would probably I probably wouldn't go to it right away, but I probably would have eventually gotten that one. But this one reject us allure prepare to duel man's frailty. I, the only thing I can think of is, like, die. Like, use the thing to revive yourself. Like, you know, have to resolve, somehow die, and then reject death's allure, prepare to duel man's frailty. Like, it seems like something about getting close to death. Oh, okay, giving blood to the shrine. So that makes sense, but how do you give your blood to the shrine? Now let's let's go do it. Can say armor. So we have it equipped. Um, let's go back over here. How do you give your blood? I'm trying to think. Is it, um. 
And there, there might be something I'm missing that, like, I don't have. Is there a weapon that hurts you? Yeah, I see the red circle on the shrine. I don't know how to give your own blood. Like, I, I, I you can get covered in blood. Find a way, like, I jump off of something? That's the only thing I can think of. Let me, let me think. Let me try. I mean, there's some pretty high points up here. Guess that doesn't count. Gotta wound myself in front of it. Oh, uh, we can use an explosive, maybe. Uh, do these hurt me? Okay, that didn't hurt me. I need... A wind chime... Fire. I'm covered in my own blood. Oh, and then heal yourself? Oh, okay. There we go. Well, I figured out how to cover myself in blood. There we go. Hey! Nice. Oh! Yarn... Oh, they're doing a whole bunch of PlayStation exclusive stuff. Uh, the Colossus, uh, something of the Colossus. I can't remember what that game is co completely called. I was just talking with somebody on my channel about it the other day. Uh, Dementia Gaming and um, Yarnum. So this is Bloodborne. Oh, that's why they said special thanks to Shadow of the oh, Shadow of the Colossus, Bloodborne theme music. That, I was wondering in the credits why they said thank you, and then oh, there's a God of War one also. So there's a God of War special. Uh, so Yarnum Helm, a straw hat of a Ronin from a world of blood. Nice. All right, that's cool. Oh, it's the feather. It's the feather lady. Dude. I know. She, yeah, this is the the crow. The crow hunter. Yarn, yarn investments. Yeah, it's kind of like the um, the crow hunter. Yeah, it's got her the crow mark. Dude, I played so much Bloodborne. You guys, <laughs> uh, that, that's one of the few games I've got platinumed. Nice. That is cool. I like this. This is this is wicked cool. Like this is the best. Like like I love this. This is a cool way to like um. Put like uh, like stuff from other PlayStation uh, ex exclusives and, and stuff. Awesome! All right, I'll have to find the other statues. I haven't found any other ones yet, so that's cool. Dang, this has got some really cool armor in it now. Like th this DLC has got some of the best armor. Like I don't know what to wear now. Like th this is cool. All of it's cool, and I got the monkey stuff too. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> I don't know what to wear. This is kind of like um. Like this is like uh, uh, so, uh the Soulsborne games where they have like uh, what do they call them? Um, fashion Souls. <laughs> this is fashion fashion Tsushima. Doesn't quite roll off the tongue as well, but. All right. Well, thanks for the help on that one. Uh, I wouldn't have guessed the Kensei armor. That one that would that'd be hard. figured out how to damage myself. I would have figured... Uh, I, yeah, falling doesn't get blood on yourself, though. Mm, I'm going to go with the ghost armor, dude. That, it just looks too cool. Yeah, look at that. That looks, that looks so cool. Oh, with the moon, with the moon knight swords. Oh, it's just... Dude, it's just awesome. Love it.
yeah, uh, thanks. Thanks. I really appreciate the help. Um, well, I'm going to be back to play this, uh, a little bit more of this, um, uh, this at, let's see, it's 7.43, so probably like four or five hours. Um, uh, I'm going to take a small, small, small break. I'm, I'm going to upload this to YouTube, but I'm going to play a little bit of Overwatch. If you guys want to come uh, watch that, they nerfed the crap out of, um, uh, tanks. And I think the update's live now. I could be wrong, but I want to see if, uh, like how bad they've damaged the game. So, um, I'm going to go play a little bit of that. Uh, it, 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 yeah, I'm going to see if it drives me nuts or not. So I'm going to play like an hour, a couple hours of that. And then, uh, then we'll be back to play more of this. Uh, cause I want to, I'm going to try and finish this up in the next day or two. Cause this Saturday I'm doing a 24 hour stream of cyberpunk. Where I'm playing cyberpunk 2077. So, uh, come join us for that. Uh, that's starting this Saturday, some roughly in the morning time, Eastern Standard Time, so Eastern American time. Um, but that's that's kind of a big thing we're doing this Saturday, trying to get to 100 followers. So uh, thanks for following uh, Rise, uh, Rise FTN. So I appreciate that. I've beaten the I've beaten the the um, uh, the main storyline. So I've done the entire storyline. I saved this for last. Someone gave me a warning that this had kind of kind of spoilers and stuff. So it was a good idea to kind of leave it for last. So and I've unlocked new game plus mode. So um, I'm going to I am eventually going to do a, a new game plus on the hardest difficulty. And I'm going to do a Kurosawa mode where it's all black and white. So but I'm going to that's gonna be in the future. I usually play a game like go off it for a couple months or something then i come back to it just like because otherwise like um if i play too much of it i don't want to get bored of it but like just too much of a good thing so i'll I'll go off it for a little bit and then i'll get like a, a craving to play it again and i'll come back i'll play more of it so i'll go for another playthrough in a little while on a new game plus with all the stuff so on the hardest difficulty so that'll be fun Yes, I've got the new horse. Uh, I got the second horse. Yeah, so I've I've played through the entire story. I finished and I've beaten. Excuse me. The main campaign. So yep, the only thing I got left. I mean, I the main island. I haven't. I guess I've. The only thing I really haven't done is some of the side stuff. I haven't. Um. I haven't finished freeing all the villages in the the last area. In Kamiyagata. And I've done all the side stories, all that stuff. I haven't found Hot Springs or all the Fox Dens yet. I think I don't think I finished all the shrines. But I've done all the side stories. I've done the uh, main campaign and stuff like that. So I'll go back and uh, finish those up uh, eventually. But I'm working on this. Uh, so, um, But yeah, I will be back uh, later. But like I said, probably like four hours or so. Um, but I'm going to go play some Overwatch a couple hours, and then I'll take a small break to eat some food, uh, some lunch, and then uh, I'll be back and playing some of that. So um, if you want to see, just uh, just come in and check in and see what I'm doing, or otherwise I'll be back uh, probably around noonish or a little later, later, a little bit later, uh, playing some more. So I really pre appreciate the help. Uh, really cool. Uh, just really cool. I love it when they put like riddles and stuff like that in the game. I like old school, old school stuff. They don't do enough of that uh, nowadays. Um, uh, like it's a lot of too much simple stuff. I like old school stuff where it was like, uh, like, got to really figure it out. And this is really cool, like really cool stuff. I like how they do it. I wonder what the gear of war, the gears of war one's gonna look. Not gears of war, sorry, um, god of war. I wonder what the god of war one's gonna look like. I wonder if you're gonna have like. That one's going to be interesting. I wonder if it's going to be the new God of War kind of inspired, or if it's going to be the old one. Oh, you want to see the new horse? I've got the armor on it. Yeah, let me see. I chose the DLC one. When I go, f when I go for the, oh, I, okay, yep, yeah. they didn't have the armor. Never mind, because I switched up outfits. So I chose the buckskin. They have a black one, a brown one, like a pure black one, a brown one, and then a pure white one. And then the, 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 I guess, the only version of the game you can get now, the director's cut, because I think they don't even have the base version of the game anymore for sale. Um, 
uh, like on the store. Uh, the the director's cut has a buckskin. Oh, the armor that you can get. So one of the mythic tales is uh, Kurosawa Sakai's horse armor for the uh, Iki Island. Let me see where it is here. Horse saddles, horse armor. This is what it looks like. Hopefully you can see that. Let's turn it around towards the... Get, you, get the better light here. It looks... He's got the headpiece of like an Eastern a Japanese dragon. Or Chinese dragon. Got like the antlers. Yeah, I really like it. And it, 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 power, it powers up your... Uh, you get a new uh, move for your horse called the Horse Charge. Um, and uh, it power it helps power that up if you got it equipped. So, one thing I'm not really a fan of is these long tassels in the back that kind of hang off and like kind of bob around. But it's just it's just it's just a minor pick that I have, just a a, a look thing. But that's just me. But yeah, I I think it looks amazing. I like it. Looks really cool. I think it's a good. I think it's they've they've like this DLC has got like some of the best additional stuff. Like I like the I like the 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 sanct the animal sanctuaries. The fact that you like play the flute, uh, the archer things are pretty cool. Like doing the archery is night is a nice addition. They kind of change like they've added some nice additions that um, feel different from the main storyline. They could have been really basic, simple, or they could have just like cheesed it out, cheaped it out, and just done the exact same thing from the base story and they added said they added some um new new things like the like the the animal sanctuaries with the the flute and stuff like that so um yeah and they've added some really new interesting things and the ar all the different armors they've added quite a few of those so those are really cool yeah i, I yeah technically basically yeah so, uh, you're not paying any anything additional. So if you pay, you're just buying the game and you're getting it in in, in in addition, I guess technically it's not free if you bought the base game and then you buy an, another copy of the game. But I'll be honest, it's kind of it's kind of worth it's kind of worth it. The game's it's just the game's just good, and, and the uh, the uh, the the multiplayer was free too. Like they added the multiplayer afterwards. Uh, and there was no, you know, no additional, any, any cost. So, yeah, this game is really good. So, all right. Uh, well, I'll be on to Overwatch. I'll be back on streaming in probably about less than 10 minutes. Uh, uh, I hope to see you there. Uh, I will be back playing this, uh, like I said, probably around noonish. So, uh, see you guys in a little bit. Uh, thanks for the help. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, see you guys in a little while. Otherwise, uh, you guys have a good day. Oh yeah, I forgot that it was on PS Extra. Yeah, it's if you don't, especially PS Extra is definitely great if you don't have any, um, if you if you don't have a lot of the game. Hopefully, as they continue to add games to it, it, it I think it'll continue to be worth it. Um, it's not quite, I think, to the Xbox Pat. What is it? The the I can't remember what it's called. The Xbox Pass or whatever uh, level yet, because that has quite a bit of stuff. But I think eventually it'll kind of get there. So if they if they can if they eventually get to the point where they add PlayStation exclusive games right as they come out, also like you can play Ragnarok right when it comes out if you're paying for uh, extra or you know paying for it, um, then I think that would be a huge boon to it because you can do that for certain Xbox game Xbox exclusive games come out right away on the Xbox Pass, um, but yeah. Uh, there's a lot of good games on there, and this is a. Uh, I, I I think I think all the content is on the 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 PS Extra one. I don't think there's anything missing. I think you get the director's cut, so, which is the most recent version. So, all right. Well, I will see you guys later. I will be back in about uh, like I said about ten minutes. So, I uh, hope to see anybody. Uh, otherwise, you guys have a good day. Uh, yeah. Bye bye now. <laughs>